And the Celtics get the win. Back-to-back 20-point -back games for Schroeder as the Celtics get to 500 with a 122-113 win. Boston uh, has turned things around here a little bit now. Uh, Tatum's numbers still not where you'd like to be, but the Celtics as a team have won four of five. What's going right now for Boston? I think the ball moving. Other guys are getting involved. Dennis Schroeder tonight, coming off his second good game early in the season, he started off slow. And they're just getting everyone involved. Look, I know how painful it was for those guys, for Jalen Brown and Tatum, to hear Marcus Smart call them out publicly. And again, <clears throat> that's something Marcus Smart could have did and had the same effect behind clothes, but he did it. How those guys have responded shows you that they're men and they're pros. A lot of guys could have went back to Marcus Smart chirping, you know, I'm not going to deal with him to call me out like that. But to confront it, have a meeting, deal with it like men, like teammates, like brothers, and then come out on the floor and start playing better basketball. That's the thing that I like. I'm not crazy about the manner in which he did it, mm -hmm. but I love the residual effect of it because when you look at it, Marcus Smart, who was playing bad, is playing better. Tatum, they don't have Brown right now. Even though he's not shooting the ball as efficient as we like, they're starting to win games now. They're climbing themselves out of hole in six and six with a chance to get past 500 soon. Tatum at 27 on 25 shots, not super efficient, yeah. and still just one assist. And if I'm not mistaken, he's never averaged more than five in a season. If he's going to be a superstar type player, where do those numbers sort of be or need to be? I you know, I, I think for him, um, it, the numbers of assists, like you said, might maybe never be high, but I think um, for me, if you're not a guy that's going to pass it and move it around with that ability, it got to be efficient. I think you got to be able to shoot a higher percentage. Uh, I, I'm okay. You don't have to pass me the ball if you shoot 56. You sure, know what I mean? yeah, that, yeah. that's the part. But yeah. I think when you're not efficient and you're taking a lot of shots, I think that's where teammates start to look and say, "Hey, we understand the uh, the pecking order. You and Jalen Brown are our best players. But when both of you guys are taking 30 shots to get 30, and we're losing, I have, I'm with Sam." Marcus Smart had all, every right. He's a defensive player. He's been there. I would have loved to have been in closed doors. But somebody had to step up and say, hey, guys, we got to move the basketball. And this is old school, Matt. If you're good enough to draw a double, somebody's open. Right. You've done your job. You've done your job. <laughs> You've done your job. Yeah. Well, the other part of the equation is Tatum takes really difficult shots. It is. If he gives it up, it's likely to come back his way for an easier shot later in the possession. You know, and, and, and to Matt, you said it's best. It's like you don't really have to. I understand the end of games, you know, superstars sure. are going to take shots. But if why should it be difficult? Because I'm usually going to beat my guy. And at 6'7", six, 6'8", six, I usually have an advantage to see over. And you're playing with some talented players. Shooter's very talented. Marcus Smart knows how to play. Al Horford's unselfish. And Jalen Brown. Somebody should have a better shot than you versus you forcing a bad shot. For all guys, not just Jason Tatum. Right. Yeah, I mean, I agree. You know, they, he's got to continue to improve on those assists. He's got to keep moving the ball. They got to pick up their defense. They're not a big team, so they got to gain rebound. And then they got to get out in transition. Dennis Schroeder is a better player when he can get out in transition, get to the basket, draw the defense, and kick it out. He's not one of those point guards that's going to dribble, 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 come off high screen and roll and just find somebody. He is a scorer. Yep.